Hey everyone, I'm back with a brand new workout. It is seven different exercises and it's a 21 minute workout. So for everyone who is advanced, do the full 21 minutes. And whoever is just beginning, just do two rounds of uh, 14 minutes. So that's it, let's get started. I'm gonna go through each exercise and show you how to do it. So all you're gonna need is your mat and your gym boss timer. So um, let's get started. It's a strictly all body weight workout. So you're not gonna need any equipment at all. And it's really going to challenge your cardio. So let's go. The first exercise is surf. So you're going to need your mat and you're gonna use it like it's your surfboard. So first thing you wanna do is to lay down on your belly. Your hands are going to be on either side of you and this is the advanced version. You're gonna jump up but stay low to one side. So you're gonna jump and stay low. And then you're gonna get back down and you're gonna jump to the other side. So you're gonna repeat that over and over for 50 seconds. And for the modified version for complete beginners, you're going to get down on your belly and you're going to step with one leg, pop up, step, and stay low. And then you're going to get back down and do it again to the other side. You're going to push up, step forward, and stay low. And that's the first exercise. Exercise number two is a one leg push up and you're going to alternate. So you're going to get down in the push up position. You're going to put one leg up in the air and do a push-up and then alternate. For complete beginners, do them from your knees. You can put one leg up in the air, keep your body straight and push up. Alternate. Let's Exercise number two. The third exercise is a leg drop and a toe touch. This is for your core. So you're going to get down on your back. And you're going to put your feet up in the air. Keep your arms out. And you're going to drop your legs. Do not touch your, your heels to the ground. You want to keep your Heels about six inches from the ground. Back up and then touch your toes. Again, drop, up, touch. Drop, up, touch. For complete beginners, I want you to um, just keep your feet up in the air. Don't do the leg drop and just do toe touches. So for complete beginners, feet up. Just toe touches. And that's it. Exercise number three. Exercise number four is mountain climbers. So you're going to get down in the push-up position. Start with one foot forward. And it's like running on the ground. So you're just going to switch feet and you're going to tuck your knee as close to your chin as you can but you're gonna keep going so it's at like a running speed. For a moderate version, just slow it down. And for complete beginners, just start in the push-up position and just tap and go back. Tap, feet together. Tuck your knee, feet together. And that is exercise number four. Exercise number five is a lunge back and jackknife. So stand straight and you're gonna do a back lunge. And then on your way forward, I want you to drive that back knee up in the air. And then switch. that is exercise number five. Exercise number six is a side burpee. 
So what you're going to do is start by putting your hands on the ground and you're going to jump your feet to the side. So hands down by your feet and jump out. Then do a push up. Jump your feet back to where they first started. And jump up with your hands up in the air. And then alternate sides. For complete beginners, you're going to be stepping to the side. So hands down, step out to the side, drop to your knees, do a push-up. Unless you can do a regular push-up, step forward and either just stand up or you can do the jump. So again, I'll do the other side for complete beginners. That's exercise number six. The last exercise is exercise number seven. It's a side-to-side -side low squat. So you want to start with your feet shoulder width apart, and you're going to get low, and then you're going to take one step to the side and squat. And but you're going to stay low. So back feet together, other side, squat low. Side, squat. If you want to make it more difficult, you can grab some weight. Otherwise, if you're a complete beginner, there really is no modification for that. So, again, feet shoulder width apart. You want to get low. You're going to touch to the side, squat. Feet together, squat. Feet together, squat. But you're staying low the entire time. And that's it. That's exercise number okay, seven. Okay, that was it. That is seven exercises. Um, for the uh, complete beginners, I want you to complete two rounds for 14 minutes. And for the more advanced, I want you to complete three rounds for 21 minutes. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the workout. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.